Well done, Roberto. That's second gold in two nights, this time in the 200 fly. How was that race for you? Yeah, I'm, I'm over the moon to have won it. It's the first time I've won a British Champs in the 200 fly, so uh, very, very happy with that. Very disappointed with the time, on the other hand, though. I was really hoping to go quicker tonight. Ended up being a really close race, and you had to be old adversary Joe Roebuck to take it by uh, less than 0.1 in the end. Yeah, it's always it's been close between us for four or five years now. Uh, that's the first time I've managed to beat him uh, in the, in the, at the British Champs, so I'm really, really happy with that. And um, de definitely taking another gold is it's really pleasing for me, but I was just hoping to be closer to the uh, qualifying time and also my personal best, which is a bit disappointing. You're known for your 400 IM, you've won so many golds at British level. You always say 200 fly is your favourite event and your fun event though, how far do you want to take it? I, I don't want to give it up, as long as I'm swimming I'm going to keep doing the 200 fly just because A, it's, it's very very important for the 400 IM which is obviously my main event but like you just said I enjoy it the most, uh, it's, always, it's been the first event I really took up when I was a kid so I always loved it, I always want to keep it going and like I said today is the first time I've won it so I'm really happy with that but I want to be moving on in the times and getting further up the world rankings, so that's my aim from now. And that sets up a chance of a, a glorious golden hat-trick here this week. What do you think about that? Yeah, like, I didn't really think about it before the week, before I came into the week, but now I've got two out of the way. Hopefully uh, I'll be able to put in another good race on Tuesday and uh, win that one as well. Thanks, well done.